Hey Simlies, it's Delicracy here with Let's Play The Sims 4 Barbie Part 34, I think, unless I made an extra part, which means this is 35. I got a bit confused with the time frame of recording in the last part. Anyways, so it is almost Jem's birthday. Oh little Jem's gonna grow up and it's gonna be so cute. I love him though. Anyways, so he's eating, getting his brekkie together. So it's Jem's birthday, pretty much. It's a Saturday, but it's also Barbie's birthday. Like she's really about to age up so I think we're gonna have a bit of a party with the whole fam we're gonna get her up we're gonna quickly um oh, we might get Margie to bake some cakes oh no she's not really in a primo mood is she Ken's just upgrading so we might get him to catch a few winks before he gets uh into a party mood so <laughs> that was very cute Gem. uh oh, I always go bake for baking a cake We'll do like a white cake for Barbie. So Jem's about to age up and he like he, his character is that he's active. So we could get him really into sports. Um a lot of a lot of viewers thought that he should be gay from the start. Um I've already had a gay sim who was athletic, Ashton from my Sims 4 LP. Um, so I feel like that would be kind of doing a similar character. So I don't know about Jem being gay. I mean, I'm not going to say no, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to say a definite yes. We'll see how he turns out in any case. I wonder if he can bake a cake. No, he can't. Sad times. So for the little party party, uh, we might just have like a pool party down here. <laughs> well, Marge is already on the barbecue, so she's already getting into it. Um, why is Amethyst in such a poor mood? Oh gosh, she's like really struggling. She's kind of become a loner too. Uh, don't worry, we'll have some fun time soon. Oh my gosh, quickly Barbie, quickly, quickly put candles on here before someone eats it. Add birthday candles. Thank you. And then we're going to make you bake one more. Hopefully she doesn't age up in the next few minutes because that would be really annoying right before the party. And we'll invite all the friends. Um, okay, good. Amethyst is going to eat with her grandma outside, which sounds beautiful. So it's going to be like a brunchy party, birthday celebration, a few close friends, nothing too crazy. I'm going to speed this up a little bit. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Just thinking about fires. Okay, add birthday candles, and then we have two beautiful birthday cakes for her and Jem. Oh, add birthday candles. You can't, then why did you put it there if you can't reach it? Add birthday candles. Oh my god, so it's Topaz and Jem's birthdays. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's like three in one day. Okay, let's quickly get this party started. Plan a social event. We could do something different for a change. <laughs> um, maybe a yes. black and white party, although they're not really Labarani. into the black and white theme, are they? Black and white yeah, costume party. Yeah, we could do a costume party. Yeah, costume party. Uh, so the host can be Barbie. And then we can have... Obviously, the whole family can come by. Ashley's a good friend of ours. We could have Courtney Kardashian make a celeb appearance with Kris Jenner. Christy, Teresa, Gavin, of course. Gavin always comes. And yeah, okay. And we'll get Addy. Addy too. Uh, do we want a caterer? Eh, why not? And a mixologist? Yes. We need two of them. Why can't we hire any more of that role? Okay. And we'll have it at home. Yay! Oh, Bobby, you look fabulous. <laughs> that is such a stupid costume. <laughs> oh my god. Can't wait to see what the kids decide to dress up as. I'm going to put the birthday cakes probably down here on some kind of nice, uh, nice table. Let's see what we have. 
surfaces. Mm. We'll go pink because hello, it's the Barbie mansion. One on there, and then maybe Gem can have a little blue one. And Topaz will just age up. So we'll move Topaz downstairs. And Topaz might turn out as brunette as well, I'm thinking. I would not be surprised. Okay, we've got the caterer happening, and we'll put some music on. Oh my gosh, we've had to replace so many things recently. Let's turn on to a little bit of electronica. Oh, no, nah, I'm not feeling it. Let's go pop. Barbie's definitely more pop. Let's change the volume to high. Yeah. What are you guys meant to be? <laughs> How awkward Courtney Kardashian's in the same outfit as Marge. Oh, well, at least Barbie's got her own thing. I feel like Marge just would not wear that. <laughs> I just, I really do. What? Diamond's like the Grim Reaper. That's really creepy. Oh, gosh. Okay, everyone have a boogie. Who's the hot dog? Liam Johnston. We should invite uh, Diamond's, Diamond's lover boy around to invite him and Augustus to hang out. That is, <laughs> Teresa came as an astronaut, probably because she's into Ken a little bit. What's Ken wearing? I don't even know what that outfit is. Addie's here, nice one. And where are the kids? Oh, those two are having a huggable time. I don't know why the kids aren't in costume, but we'll get them to dance in any case. Oh, Topaz isn't happy. Who's looking after him? Oh, our good friend Gavin. Of course Gavin would be helping out. Oh, I think we'll age up the baby first. And, uh, come on, Ken, we need you to be a good dad right now. Oh, they're preparing drinks at our other bar, which is kind of awkward. Can we actually, can we get our other bartender to tend to the other bar, or they're just not tending our bar? Oh, well, we better watch Topaz grow up in any case. Yay! We have another brunette kid. That's exciting. So we've done artistic. We can make him a social butterfly. Why not? And that means that he could be... Oh, it's always good to give something that'll help them in life with a career. But maybe we can just do cheerful or goofball. Or is there a good sense of humor? Creative mean. He's not going to be mean. Maybe a goofball, because then he could be humorous and get into entertainment. Maybe. I want to see what he looks like. Oh my gosh, he looks like Ken. Oh, look how happy he is. Topaz. Cute. All the kids look so much alike. <laughs> He's gorgeous. I love Topaz. Oh my gosh, Jim, you look adorable. <laughs> oh, and Amethyst, typical Amethyst, refuses to dress up. She's like, no. She really needs to have some social time, so let's get her and her brother to talk about favorite animals. Actually, let's get her to talk to her aged up brother. That's what we should do. Enthuse about candy and take pictures together and tell a goofy story. Yay! Marge reached cooking level 5, which is pretty solid. It's a pretty solid effort. Oh, there's our boy 
West Diamond. Oh my gosh. You are so cute, Augustus. Uh, give him a heartfelt compliment, girl. Seriously. Amethyst seems like the type of kid who isn't really social as much as the others. She's more of a bookworm and clever and keeps to herself. Well, she's out of her Grim Reaper costume. And Barbie's probably like, where's the other guy? Where's the blonde guy? Oh, there he is. Oh no! He walked in. Maybe Barbie can like become friends with him and then she can invite him over. Heaps and like get to know him. Oh, Amethyst is all by herself. She's all. Oh! Okay, we'll get Barbie to continue talking to him. Um, boast about family, because she does have the best family ever. Oh, these two are so cute. Yay, Amethyst finally has a closer friend in the family. She's like, do you want a photo together? So cute. Browse kid. Let's take a photo with Topaz. <laughs> Those two are adorable. Okay, so James is self-assured. And she must like that about James. She'd be like, oh, you'd be perfect for my for my daughter. She should compliment his outfit. Okay, and where is Diamond still talking to a boy? We should probably age up one of them. Oh, cute. Alright, let's age up Barbie. Once she finishes talking to James. That sideways glance really said it all. She's like, you would be perfect for my daughter. Oh, Barbie and Ken. <laughs> Still keeping it spicy. Oh, she's busting. That's awkward to blow your candle out while busting. Yay, Barbie's an adult. That's exciting. She's a real lady now. Okay, and she needs to pee. <laughs> Not many people actually got to celebrate that, unfortunately. Oh, Jem, you look so dapper. It's probably your go to age up to. I kind of, I want the whole family to to be here though. Like, let's get Ken over here, and we'll get Diamond over here too. Like, so everyone can see. And then Jem can age up. <laughs> I love this person, Teresa, getting down with it. All right, little Jem, he looks so adorable. Yay! The whole family! Whoa! Oh my, my, my. Oh, Jem. Jem's like exactly like Diamond, but the male version. He's really attractive. Okay, so select aspiration. Well, oh my gosh, I don't know. I always have such a hard time picking this, um, but oh, does he want like successful lineage, joke stuff, friend of the world, bodybuilder? The Sims wants to work out and become as strong as they can be. Hmm. So then you'd have a high metabolism. Oh, I don't 
nor I don't know a nascent sim or s could he be into dating lots of women or it could just be something really random like a, f a fisherman um, or an outdoor enthusiast so they want to oh he could become a collector because diamond agents like collecting stuff that could be kind of cool Friend of the world, joke star. Um, I reckon we'll go with, oh, what's the Renaissance sim? He wants to be good at lots of things at once. I reckon we should collect things and he can be athletic too. Uh, materialistic, a little bit materialistic maybe. Perfectionist, outgoing. We'll make him outgoing. <laughs> Oh, he's awesome. He looks kind of bored, but he's so cute. Like, oh my gosh. They're very good looking kids. They are very, very good looking kids. Oh my gosh, look at this little cute. Oh, we had an unsuccessful party. Well, fuzzles. Oh, these two are getting along like a house on fire, I swear. Where's Diamond? Where's her... Where's her Augustus? Where's her Augustus gone? It's hard to tell when they're in costumes who's who. Uh, cute brunette guy. Barbie's just chill billing down here. Is that Augustus? No, that's Gavin. Oh, everyone's going home anyways. Well, oh, okay guys. Thanks. Thanks for coming. <laughs> oh dear. Ken's exhausted. My gosh, we have so many kids now. Oh, finally they took their picture together. Oh, he's brown head with blue eyes. That's really cute. Uh, maybe... Make it a bit brighter. Awesome. Oh, Amethyst could be like a little photographer. Who's that? Oh, that's Jem. Oh my gosh. He looks really cute without a cap on. Let's maybe, let's see if Amethyst can actually use a camera. I don't know if she can, but until she's an adult. Oh, we'll just go the long way. Um, but she, I, she might be able to. I just don't know if kids can. You can on a cannon. You can do. <laughs> Sorry. Just broke out into random song and dance just then. Oh, maybe we can use it and she can go around and take pictures of all her family. Oh, sweet, that's awesome. We can take pictures with other people. Let's take a picture of Topaz. We can say Topaz got a camera for his birthday and he's let her use it. Oh, they're not very good at having different poses, are they? But at least we can put some family portraits around the house, which would be really nice. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, maybe she can take a picture of Diamond. Whoops. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Take photo of... Oh, I want to take a photo of Diamond. Get to go in here. See if she can take a photo of. Oh. <laughs> why can't we take a photo of most of the family? Like, why is it different people every time? Is What is Jem wearing? Whoops. Like, he looks kind of somewhat put together. Let's have a chat to him then and <laughs> annoy. Let's see. <laughs> I don't think I've seen this interaction actually. I guess because she's feeling playful. It's interesting that the younger kids are coming out brunettes and the old ones were all blonde. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, this is really annoying that she can't just take a photo of anyone. Take photo with... I don't get it. It just like changes every time. Oh, I'll take a photo of Ken then. 
Viva Groovy! Polka, yes, yes. What? <laughs> <laughs> this is really cute family time in this part. I like it. Oh, they just became good friends. Aww. He's good friends with his little sister. I love that. Barbie's still in a clown costume. Oh. Oh, wow. That's so clever because she's a kid. Her perspective is uh, different because she's shorter. It's not the best pose of Ken, but oh well. Uh, where, where? I've got the walls down. Let's maybe put the camera here so Ken can take some photos too. Let's get him to take a picture of Diamond. <laughs> it's kind of an awkward photo of her, but it's okay. We can have them up around the house at least. Cute. Who else can we take a photo of? Uh, we'll get a picture of Jem now that he's aged up. <laughs> that is such a hi, mom photo. <laughs> oh, classic. They all be. Well, we'll make a few sideways and some bigger, some smaller. Lovely. And who else do we have in the family that we need to take photos of? Uh, Amethyst. And Marge and Topaz. One, two, three, four. So they have four kids. Oh, come on, you have to take a photo of your remaining children. <laughs> we could actually get a full-on photo studio. Oh. <laughs> oh, cute. Uh, we might do it this way. That's so cute. Very amethyst. I guess you could call it Amy for short. And then lastly, take a photo of Topaz. Oh, we need Marge too, but I do want Marge to get out of this funny costume. Oh! <laughs> oh, hey, Topaz. What a player. Oh, we're taking little photos, my bad. Um, change outfit to everyday too. And then we'll take a picture of her. <laughs> this is capturing all of their personalities just so well. And Barbie, maybe we can get her out of her funny outfit. And uh, we'll get a picture with Barbie. have one together. I would love to get a big like, oh, she earned 123 from investing. That's good. I'd like them to get a big family portrait. I wish you could do that in The Sims 4. Oh, what? That's cute. That is very cute. Uh, I could take a few. Okay, now let's find, like, to finish up this part, we'll find a spot to put all of these photos. Um, where can we put them? We could put them in the entrance room. Like, on this wall when you... Or on this wall when you walk in, maybe? Or on the green wall? Uh, which side? I might put them on this side. We'll delete this for now so we can have all the family photos over here. Uh, let's see. Hopefully we have some nice ones to to use. 
Not very big, are they, for meaning to be a big photo? It's kind of disappointing. Oh, there we go. Here's the family portraits coming together. So cute! Um... Who are we missing? Oh no, we don't need that one. Mm, that's blurry. It's a shame. Um, they didn't really all work out, did they? What about diamonds photos? So confused. New eight. Oh, okay. So we've got some here. It's overexposed. That's quite a good one, but we've already got that up. Blurry. Oh, it's just annoying how they all come out blurry and stuff. Because that's such a nice photo, but we can't use it. Until we get our skill up. Oh, well, we have some photos at least. Which is good. That looks like another photo from that I took in another... In, like, that photography shoot we did. Any more photos? No. That's tiny. Oh, we can just add frames to these. Oh, the one with Marge has a gnome in it too and I didn't even realize. Oh, well, at least we have that one. Okay, we're just started to get a bit of a family wall of photos, which is nice. We might put Barbie and Ken like that and we put Gem there. We'll take some more photos in the next part. Anyway guys, hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon or evening wherever you are in the world and I will speak to you soon. Thank you.